Here's a short demonstration to help you learn how to use a Cobra 40 series power drain cleaning machine. Tools and supplies needed for the job are a pair of leather gloves, a rag, safety glasses, and a screwdriver. Your particular machine may have a yellow or blue frame depending on where you purchase the machine, but the information in this video applies to either machine. This video was not meant to replace the instruction manual that came with the machine. Read the instruction manual first to fully understand how to safely operate and maintain your machine before you use it. This video will just show the basic operation. This machine is designed to clean 2 inch to 4 inch drain lines. Common applications include sinks, floor drains, and roof stacks. It is not designed to clear tree roots from pipes. Run a large drain cleaning machine with at least a 5 8 inch diameter cable or hire a professional plumber for the difficult task of clearing tree roots. Before using any power drain cleaning machine, you must always wear snug fitting leather gloves and safety glasses. Never use cloth or fabric gloves. They can get tangled in the cable and can cause severe injury. Do not wear any loose clothing, rings, or wrist watches, and be sure to tie back long hair. These items could get caught in the spinning cable. If drain cleaning chemicals have been used in the drain, be careful to avoid contact with the cable or with liquid splashing back on you from the drain. Serious burns to the skin or eyes could occur. Always wear safety glasses whenever cleaning any drain. Never place the machine in a puddle of water near the drain as it could create an electrical shock hazard. If you need to use an extension cord, make sure it is at least a 16 gauge heavy duty outdoor extension cord. This is a manual feed drain cleaning machine, meaning you must pull the cable out and push it back in the drum when finished. So let's begin. With machine unplugged and motor in the off position, middle switch position, place the machine no more than two feet from the drain opening. Attach a cutter to the end of the cable using a screwdriver. Consult your manual for the appropriate cutter. Here we'll use the spearhead cutter, which is designed to punch a hole through the clog and re-establish water flow. Plug machine into a grounded electrical outlet and reset the GFI. Loosen the thumb screw and feed cable as far down the pipe as possible. When cable will not feed further into the drain pipe, the cable is probably stuck against an elbow or joint in the pipe or may have reached the clog. Rotating the cable will help it navigate through the pipe. To do this, place the motor in the forward position and firmly press the cable down into the pipe while depressing the foot pedal to start the drum turning. Take your time in navigating the pipe. In many cases, it will take some time to reach the clog. When you have reached the clog, tighten down on the thumb screw to prevent the cable from wanting to feed back into the drum. Do not apply excessive force on the clog too quickly. Let the cutter do its job. Continue the process of feeding cable down the drain and running the machine until all clogs are cleared. If at any time during the clearing operation the cable begins to buckle or build up too much twist, immediately take your foot off the foot pedal switch to stop the machine to reduce the amount of stress in the cable. Normal operation of the machine is with the motor switch in the forward position only. The reverse switch position is only used momentarily. In the unlikely event you get the cable stuck in the drain and cannot pull the cable back by hand. Immediately after freeing the cable, switch motor back to the forward position. We hope you found this helpful for learning the proper operation of your Cobra 40 series drain cleaning machine.